Good boy. Take camera and knuckle it. Times like these where it'd be nice to have an assistant. Why? Because they can hold the horse and work him should he should he want to move it around. And I wish I could have stayed up there for that because he lost his balance. <coughs> and I gave him the impression if he moves, I'll slide off. Which is better than giving an impression I ain't gonna come off no matter what you do, so. Good boy. Good boy. Hi, buddy. Hi, buddy. Hi, buddy. Hunt. Yeah. does leave, he's going to leave in a big hurry. It's not going to be a wander off kind of leave. Well, after this 10 minutes, I'm going to have to go get batteries. Uh, if it lasts 10 minutes. And the problem is the date's all wrong on that. Get on this guy. That was 
scary, wasn't it? What happened? Right, nice. Pulled the lead and it made him a little nervous. Come on, son. You're standing still. Good boy. Good boy. Nobody to lead. That's the rubber, remember? You're okay. That's the rubber. Okay. He's stressing about this. A lot less than I am. I agree. Huh? I agree with you. Good boy. Good boy. I think the only thing that stresses him is him losing his balance. That's generally where the trouble starts, so that's what this is all about anyway. Want me to tell you when he licks and chews? What? Want me to tell you when he licks and chews? No. I just gotta do that till I feel like he don't want to stand here much longer. Slide off. Start over. Licking and chewing. Pretty boy. Okay. You're okay. Why don't you walk around, my little brother? I think he's getting past acceptance now. I mean, tolerance. tolerance. Well, we'll see. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. balance. He stepped a little bit and I lost my balance. So what happened? He seems concerned about that rope. He is a little. He got rewarded. For he moving. I gotta lose that. Bring some weights on my feet or something. <laughs> I got you some leg weights, baby. <laughs> That's a joke. Last thing I need during this is more weight. 
Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. I mean, you got to set it up where you slide off the left side if something should happen. But, uh, but, you don't want to fall off every time they catch their balance. Good boy. Good boy. Boy. How do you know what's acceptance and what's tolerance? Tolerance, they have an unsure look on their face, but they're tolerating. But they're not doing, they're not having any adverse reaction that you can see. Uh, they don't look real comfortable. And even after a while of tolerating, they will start looking com comfortable. But it's also, they get to that point where, okay, that's all I can stand to think about. Now I'm going to look straight ahead and not think about it. And then when their mind does go back to thinking of, that's when they have the problem. And that's when you got to work it past toleration to accept it. Well, where is he? Okay. He's different. He's different in that everything we do to him is brand spanking new. <laughs> So he's going to do the same thing, but he's going to actually work through the time. He's not going to be real tolerant. See, broke, tame horses, domestic horses have a tendency to be tolerant because you've been jacking with them since birth. These guys ain't especially tolerant, but they're pretty good to accept things that they see ain't going to hurt them. They're extremely adaptable. Anything that doesn't hurt them, they tend to accept. Now, does that mean he won't have big problems? No. But here's what it does mean. He ain't lying to me right now. He's telling me exactly what he thinks. He's not He's not in denial. He's not in la-la land. If he don't like it, he'll tell me that quick because he'll scooch away. What is he thinking right now? Right now he's going... He's just kind of paying attention to what I'm doing, but you can see he's looking pretty relaxed, got his head kind of low. Watch his head when I get on him. Blinks a lot. He's blinking. Ain't doing a whole lot of licking and chewing, but nope, I'm just, just trying to get some repetitions on here. So if he feels something a little different, it don't it don't worry him. Because every time you do this, it's going to be a little different. You'll touch a spot you haven't touched before, which is kind of the whole point of the exercise. Now is his head way up in there, and he looking worried? His head's not way up, but it's higher than it was a minute ago. Right. But in a minute, it'll go back down, it's though. Not, it's not as high as it was. The first few times we did this, right? No. Right? No. You're a good boy. But you're pulling on his lead I rope. Know it wasn't completely an accident. Whoa. What happened? That's what happens when the when they get the lead a little too long and you get off your balance is off the back. It you looks like He's a little bit too concerned about that lead, but... It looked like you panicked more than he did. What? I mean, you know what I mean. Yeah, I know exactly what you mean, and I know exactly what you said. I know exactly where you said it. No, I didn't panic at all. I was trying to stay on so he could work through it. Mmm. And he got faster and faster. And you fell off? When he starts getting that, uh, worried about it, you've got to get off and give him some relief. Oh, okay. Now, I'm sure the video will reveal what it looks like, and I appreciate the, your commentary, but <coughs> what really got him panicking was not just my being up there and being feeling that off-balance load. It was a lead rope. Thing. At any rate... This was your buddy, huh? Did you forget that was your buddy? Come here. 